Hello, greetings. This is Cole. Um, we're going to be doing a quick little tutorial on how to compress and also upscale using um, Shutter Encoder. We're not going to be using the AI upscaling. We're going to be using uh, more. It's more like FSR upscaling. If you're familiar with uh, AMD's uh, Fidelity Super Resolution, it's more like that. But uh, I just download Shutter Encoder and install it. It's free. Free, free software, free, free piece of program. I'll probably leave a link in the description where you can download it. So just look in the description. But here you go. You, you can drag and drop your file here or browse for a file. Well, I've got a file here. We're going to use my uh, Dead Space Part 2 here. It's 214 gigabytes. Now, I recorded this near lossless, not quite lossless, but it's about a 47-minute video. And we're going to just drop it in there. And then what you want to do is to choose a function. There's a lot of things you can do. You can cut without re-encoding, replace audio, rewrap, conform. You can merge files if you had more than one. You can do sound conversions. You can do editing codecs or output codecs. What we want to do is we want to convert this to H.265. Which that already is H.265, but we're going to compress it, make it smaller. We're also going to upscale it. So as you can see, the source, here's, here it is, open here. And um, you want to switch... Switch this from VBR to CQ. We're gonna we're gonna set it for this. This is a 1080p video, so we're gonna set it to about 17 or 18. Either one of these can be about right for what we're do for what we're doing here. Um, as for the audio settings, we're not gonna uh, we're not we're gonna just gonna copy the audio. We're gonna copy it. We're not gonna convert it. We don't want to keep converting it if we don't need to. We're gonna select max quality here, and then for the source, the scale. We're going to select 3840 by 2160. That is 4K. This is 3840 by 2160. You can also go 1440p or QHD, but this is Ultra HD. So that's what we'll do. So we'll set that. Now the last thing we have to do is we have to go down here to Hardware Acceleration and select NVIDIA NVENC, or if you have an AMD card, there would be AMD codec here maybe, or an Intel codec. So... Um... Now we just start function. You just click start function and it'll start. This is how you can upscale. But before you do all of that, make sure you go into your settings and where it says set scale mode to, make sure you set Langsazos. Lang Langkazos. Is that how you say that? Uh, just make sure you set that because that's the best for upscaling. It's 32 samples. So, And then that'll upscale. And I'm just going to pause this recording until this is upscaled. Until it's almost done, it's going to be about an hour and 37 minutes for a 47-minute video. And that's not bad. And the upscale actually looks really good. So it does a good job. But we're going to pause it for now, and then we'll unpause the video when uh, we're done here. Okay, the video has just finished uh, compressing and upscaling, and it, it dropped it from 214 gigabytes to 74. Now, if you're on a slower connection, or you need fi smaller file sizes yet, what you can do is you can go over to the CQ and raise this up further. The further up you raise this, the smaller the file size you're going to get. Now you can try 22 or 24 if if 17 is still too big. I wouldn't go much beyond 24 though because then you're really chewing into your, your the clarity of your image and the quality because this is bitrate. This is how many how much how much data is packed in per per second of video. So but uh, as you can see, it is a lot smaller now than 214 gigs. Here is the... As you can see, it's 1920 by 1080. As you can see, and now we'll go to... Looks good. So, and, um, let's see if I'm forgetting anything else. Yeah, before you do all that, make sure you go to this cog up here in the corner to go to settings and then set the scale mode to Lankzos. Lankzos. Yeah, do that. And then, um, don't forget NVIDIA NVENC down here. Uh, CUDA CUDA. Like these CUDA. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Yeah, uh, pardon. Anyway, I just didn't, I just made this video for a friend of mine mostly, just to help him out. He wanted to know how to do it. 
uh, he's a, my good brother, Kenny. And, uh, so that's pretty much it. Um, if you have any questions or anything, just post them in the comments.